What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video and today we're going to be working on progress 4 of our Thermal Take Tower 900 PC build and I have a bit of an announcement to make. We have mwave.com.au jumping on board providing the CPU for this build and we also have Kingston jumping on board providing the memory and of course the SSDs for the build. So big shout out to those guys. I'll leave their links down below if you guys want to go check out the mwave store or Kingston Technologies and find out more. Today, we will be working primarily on the boat and the case. We wanna get some of the paintwork done so we can get further into the details of the whole build. Now, at the moment, what I've been doing is I've been using my acrylic to cut out some of these guardrails which will be going on the boat. So in the previous video, we actually cut down this section and now we've actually made it curve upwards like you can see right here. So what I've done is I've cut the acrylic out using my jigsaw blade with a plastic cutting blade and now I'm filing back that section so I can stick those rails on flush with the ground of the boat. I just used a two-part epoxy to stick this on. It dries within five minutes so it is a perfect solution to stick it on. I also used my heat gun to give a bit of curvature to match the shape of the boat so that it sticks in place nice and even. I'm also sticking the top guardrails back on using my acrylic weld solution because obviously we do have some acrylic open on the top free for us to weld these side rails on. Now we're actually starting with some of the detail on the sides of the boat. I'll be putting this strip on, which is part of holding the ropes for the sails up. And then I'll also be putting the ladders on, which is just some small little acrylic rectangle bits, which will be stuck in place using our two-part epoxy. And of course, our cannon windows, which are also stuck in place. Now we're doing our first layer of primer, followed by our third layer of primer. And it is a gray primer because we want some gray to show through once we use this paint on it. Now, the key with this paint is, is to put it on as messy as you can. The reason is because this paint actually has some metal bits in it. And once we put the second part acidic solution on there, it's actually going to make that metal within the paint rust. So we're going to be turning it a nice brown color. And I did this with my tank PC build, if you guys remember that. Also sprayed a bit of aged copper over that, so that will also show through through all of that rust. Now what I'm doing is I'm putting that second acidic part on, and over time that'll start browning up and bronzing. Now once it starts to rust, I'll then use a clear over that to stop it at its part, and that clear will actually darken it and make it look a bit like dirt, but the dirt's going to have different tones in it, and that's the look that I want to achieve. I'm now painting the case in the same solution. It looks black at the moment, but once you add that acidic solution to it, it starts turning brown. Here's what it looks like with three coats of that metal paint. So I've got it all over the build. It looks very messy at the moment, guys, but don't worry, trust me, it will turn out looking really nice. You can see it's starting to brown up a tiny bit, so I'm putting the second coat on, and I'm gonna leave it overnight, and then tomorrow I'm going to be starting on the finer details and paintwork. I'm gonna make this look really good, guys, so definitely don't count this build out. If you guys don't like the look yet, trust me, it's going to look really good. So putting that solution over the case as well, trying to get that nice and browned up. And what I'm going to be doing is I'm going to be putting a lot of moss 
and just stuff that's real piratey themed around this build. I'm also going to be making a nice acrylic guard for that fan section that you can see. And here's how the boat is turning out at the moment, starting to turn a bit brown. I'm also going to be using a bit of vinyl to try and create the wooden panel details. I hope you are all enjoying this progress. Thank you very much for watching. Remember to check out more videos on the channel, lots of custom PCs, reviews, and modding tutorials. And we'll see you all in the next one. Yeah. <laughs>